I want a phone. You can't have a phone until you're 12, you know that. Why 12? That's so arbitrary. Because that's when you're old enough to be responsible for it. You guys lose your phone every time you go to wine tastings. For real? Just a lady trapped in a lawn chair. Forward me that. <laughs> If I can't have a cell phone, you guys should at least put down yours so we can eat like a family. Yeah, it's a great idea. Yes, we should do... Yeah. <laughs> she can't get out of there. <gasps> Give it. So they want you to be 12, huh? It seemed like a long time to wait. And the worst part is it won't be magical when I'm 12. It'll just be another thing to shrug at. Because the little girl inside me will be dead. She's gonna die? She's already dying. Get in the car. I cannot believe this is happening. I'm gonna be able to text you now, Pop Pop. Ah, don't you dare ever grow up. I won't have to now. I'll be happy forever. Pop Pop's little honey bunny. Boop, boop. <laughs> Who's texting you so late? Huh? Oh, uh, I think it's more fun if we have our little secrets, don't you? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're right. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't ask if I don't want to tell. Tell what? Joni? <laughs> How do you type a firework? Oh, hey there, little Miss Pocketbook. Such a lady. Yep. Excuse me. Ripped one. <laughs> That's what happens when you make me eat vegetables. Little crop duster. Okay, I'm calling you right now. Ah, look at that. Your sweet little face pops up. It'll do it every time I call. Isn't that so cool? Oh, I love that. All right, who's up for some ice cream? I'm gonna go call you from my backyard. But ice cream? I just love the Price Club. I mean, they got everything there. They even had a book signing last week, the Diary of a Wimpy Kid Guy. You read those? Oh my gosh, uh, I have to Those Wimpy Kid books. Sophia? <sighs> Uh-oh. <sighs> Is something bothering you, sweetheart? I think I really screwed up, Joni. Hmm. I'm so embarrassed to even tell you. Well, use a hypothetical if that helps. Oh, yeah. A friend of mine went and bought his granddaughter a cell phone. You dumb son of a bitch! I said it was a friend of mine. You have to tell Heather! You have to! She has rules about these things! I didn't fly in two wars to have my daughter tell me what to do. Now, you tell her for me. Uh, she gets really scary when she's mad. Oh, please, honey. It just is so dumb. I'm sorry. I just love seeing her happy. Wow. And you know, I, I, did, I made a mistake. So just take it easy on her. You know, like give her a toy uh, or a cookie, ice cream. Bring her some ice cream and then tell her. Oh, oh, you, you think that I'm going to tell her? What? Oh, no. You bought her the cell phone so you can take it away. Have fun with that. Maybe you get her some ice cream, a really nice toy. She'll be a good time. Oh, no, please. No, she's so scary when she's mad, Heather. Heather! Anyway, it seems that Pop Pops make mistakes, too, I guess. I'm so sorry, Angel. I thought you were different. So? It's OK. I guess you have to be sad sometimes to know what happy feels like. I got an idea. Um, you want to get your ears pierced? Really? Can we go right now? Um, now? <laughs> <laughs>